All right, guys, Brandon Green here. Let's get into another reaction video. We've got the team here, uh, Man vs. Street. They're good conservative people, and they go around asking people what's going on. They've asked, has fat acceptance gone too far? Let's get into it. Of course it is. Is it okay it to be fat? No, I don't think it's good for people to good be unhealthy. Good God. I think it's okay to be fat. You know, everyone has different lifestyle habits, and their bodies are built differently, so. What do you guys think about Lizzo? <laughs> do you think she's, like, healthy? Fuck yeah. She's vegan. Like, she's active. I'm seeing her on TikTok. She's dancing. She's working out. <laughs> Do you think Lizzo is healthy? I don't know if that girl's serious or not, or trolling. No. Why don't you <laughs> think Lizzo is healthy? Because she's overweight. <laughs> what do you think about like Lizzo? Do you think she's healthy? Yeah, I know she's big, like a bigger woman, but I don't know like if she actually eats really good. Like she might eat better than me. Ah, uh, looking at her, I doubt it. Unless she's got some fucking serious issue going on. Got a thyroid out. <laughs> She might be fucked, actually. She's... People get that big, like, it's got to be genetic, surely. Like, fuck me, she's massive. So she could be. Do you think it's okay to be fat? I don't think it's okay to be, like, a thousand pounds. It doesn't matter how you look as Good. long as you're healthy. 800. Everyone has a different body type. Do you think it, uh, you can be healthy and obese at the same time? No. Uh, those things are almost opposites in a lot of ways. I think you can just because... A lot of times it is super mental and it is literally genetic where like yeah. sometimes you're eating healthy and your body literally that's just how you look like. I think people have like health issues that cause them to like not be able to lose weight as easily as others. Do you think you can be healthy and obese? I think it's a yes and no because I know some fat people that literally are super healthy like eat the best and everything they just can't lose weight. So I think yes. Some people have to work way harder to be like more in shape I guess. So what if someone is like yeah. has high blood pressure? a lot of apologizing going on here for the fat people but there are fat people that go to the gym and they just stay kind of big so i can understand that sure high cholesterol falls in that obese but if you've got if you're fat as fuck and you eat fat as fuck and you've got everything wrong cholesterol blood sugar blood pressure then you're a fat fuck and you need to fix it, you know what I mean? This category, would you still consider them healthy? <laughs> no. <laughs> I think healthy, like, depends on multiple things, like mental, physical, like, you know, your nutrition, like. A certain weight comes with certain health complications, so I don't know if those two can coexist, but I bet you those people sure are happy. If you actually care about people, don't lie to them. Like, if, if I had a loved one that was yeah. overweight, I would want them to lose weight. Like, I think everybody's like that, so. Because it's unhealthy. Yeah, dude, because you're going to die sooner. You'll get cancer. <laughs> I mean, like, I lost parents because they gained weight and they weren't healthy. Like, it's the consensus is it's so you can be healthy and obese. Yeah, I mean. Even if you have high blood pressure, high cholesterol, on the verge of a stroke. That might not be your fault. Mm -hmm. But that's genetic, too. That could just get passed on to me, and I'm... It could, 100%. But at the same time, people who are obese all have those th same things in common. Fair. I can't really argue with that. That's true body positivity <laughs> you think it creates like a pop when it's funny when fucking facts smack you in the face isn't it relation of more fat people no <laughs> because body positivity isn't like yeah just go gain a fuck ton of weight it's a community for people to like i don't know do you think body positivity creates like a population of more fat people um yes <laughs> because no one is getting shamed for their body size as often anymore so the whole, do you think body positivity creates... Yeah, but these people surely wouldn't be confident about their fucking fat bodies. Even if it's been all allowed to be... Or made to be hushed and swept under the rug because of fat shaming. What the fuck? Like, surely they don't... They know that they're not attractive. The population surely. of more fat people. I could it be can. wrong. Like if you use it as an excuse. There's someone that's obese and they look at bo body positivity and they're like, oh, it's okay for me to be like this and they don't t take any action. Do you think that's okay? Not necessarily, no. No, they've lost all will to live and they're suffering depression and they need to take a good hard look at themselves and get themselves right. And that's what a lot of people do when New Year's Eve comes rolling around. 1st of January, I'm going to do this. I'm prepared to be ready. Because people aren't ready until they're ready, and that's when they're ready, and they're ready to fix things. I don't think that's okay. 
uh, like fat mannequins in stores. I don't think that creates a positive thinking. Everyone has different body types and different bone structures, honestly, also too. True. Which can make you look <laughs> more obese. Like wider, or wider rib cages or bigger hips. Like that's just your body. That's not even food at that point. Yeah, I think body even if is a good thing. Even if you're obese? Even if you're obese, yes. But not if you're unhealthy. I don't think getting fatter is going to help that. I think that actually makes your problems worse. Like you're unhappier and you're more self-conscious and you're not feeling good about your body, right? So if people want to be happy, they should lose weight because that makes you happier. Like yeah. you're lighter. And I've, I lost like 20 pounds in the last six months. And the number one thing I notice is that like I'm just in a better mood. You know, you just feel better. What would you do if your kids were fat? I let them be fat. I would not <laughs> instill an eating disorder in them and encourage them to like lose weight or whatever. Instill an eating disorder on them, fucking what? So she wasn't trolling. This is a fucking idiot. Unless it was becoming like a general like problem. Why do some parents do that? Because Which they're trying to like form to societal standards. What would you do if your kids were fat? So they should. They wouldn't be. <laughs> Why? Well, because like they would just eat healthy. I would I would try to get my kids to eat healthy and lose weight because honestly, it's just difficult. It's worse on your joints. It's worse yeah. on your bones. So oh, it's now the truth comes out from these people just tiptoeing around the fucking. That's what they do. They just tiptoe around the truth. Here's the truth, and they just until they have to fucking. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Fucking lefties, fuck. That's what's wrong with the world. Need Trump back. Trump 2024.